Well, hello and welcome to Jimmerism Total Nourish Channel. <clears throat> we are here in From the Depth. We will... Right away we will go into the map and initiate movements because it takes time. Alright, fleet mood. And they are in fleet mood move. Oops, that's my phone. That's probably super loud for you. Sorry about that because it's right beside my uh, stuff there. So, yeah. We will move the fleet into position. And uh, so, well, uh, last time we did some battles and we plan to do some battles this time as well. Where is my... let's see here. I don't want to control the guns. So, uh, what the heck is this doing? Well, that's interesting. Do we have no fuel? We have a little bit of fuel? No, this is highly interesting. Uh, right, so we'll take some manual control. I don't know what this is doing. Apparently it's doing weird stuff, but uh, what the hell? Oh, I see two troops in common there. I wonder which of them we should attack first. Now, what the fuck? Now, I don't know why this refuses to get into formation, but that might be as it is. Um, yes, I will just look at my phone, so I'll just pause the recording. See you soon. All right, so things are happening. They want to engage with battle. On, we, on, they want to engage in battle with us, which is sad. So shit. Okay, what happened now? So, uh, we're here on the strategic menu, and it seems we have no materials, which sucks. And our... I don't know why this is doing. Is it something with the... that we have too little... fuel or something? Let's go into resource view here. Um, and we're going to ammo. We want to keep full fuel, but I don't want it to go home and repair and stuff. So I don't know what it's doing, but we will move it to the rest of the fleet. Um, and it's we're being blockaded, but uh, now let's see here. Fuel. Okay, I guess we don't need to... All right, so and we can give materials to this one, which we can. Whoops, wait, no, I don't know. Okay, so. Okay, never mind. We're going to C mood. Oh no. Okay, so these are blockaded. Wait, are we having some trouble over there? I hope not, because we don't have any FNs. Uh, all right, everyone attack. Right. Prepare for battle. Okay, I guess begin battle. Let's see how many crafts we can have into battle even. Uh, okay, fly fish one gear taken and what the fuck? So they could have their both? Okay, I don't understand why we can't have all our stuff, but never mind. This is not looking too great. We have, it looks like the Atlas, I think. We boarded this before. Incoming. Uh, then we have, what do we have more? We have some aircraft stuff incoming. They look pretty mean, man. That's not too great. Alright, so... It's not looking too good. Actually. Actually, let's see here. Uh, we need to go into the combat mood here. And we need to select our ship and attack this ship instead. Right, and then we have... These are more dangerous, so attack this thing. Right. Holy shit! Oh no, we are going in slow motion. 
Oh lord. We don't need a resource view now. We are shedding balloons like... Like tears for the lost materials. Basically. Right. Oh my god, I see something blew up. I am happy. Now, I don't know if... Uh, let's see here. Shit. On build, build off of fleet mood. Okay, we want it to have in combat mood. I don't know why this is not... Attacking salvage, I don't even know what that is. But, um, let's see here. That is Drake, okay. Why is that so far away? Never mind, it's 80%. Me. Engaging, now. Engaging that. Me. Engaging now. Okay. Um, now let's see here. Gear taken. Snorri Excel. We have not so many materials. We'll just jump to Gear taken to perform some repairs. I don't know if we have, uh, you know, even though it's only a few percent that's off, uh, if some, like, main systems are damaged, it is not so good. Okay, 97%. Where are we even? We have materials. So, 98%. Nice. So, we're definitely... Oh, yeah. 31% great. I'm starting to get a little hang of this flagship. Oh shit, what happened with Snorri? Okay, it's fine. It's alive. Good. Right. Oh, and here we have another vessel. Water Buffalo. Okay, and this is gear taken. Let's see here. Uh, this gear taken is more damaged. We'll get to it instead. And then we will attack with every. Basically, everything. Wreck this shit. Wreck the fucking Atlas. Right now. Holy shit, this is sad. I think I'll need to go to Snorri Excel because that thing is fucking pathetic right now. Right. And the Atlas is basically like a normal ship. The ma like the machine guns are super strong. It's pretty crazy actually how strong the machine gun has become. Wow, so close. Come on. Oh yes, full hit. But it's kind of a not too strong shot, so I mean. And there, will we have a hit? Oh yes. But actually the gear taken's uh, like front cannon is not that devastating. I don't know if it has some sad settings or if it's just kind of small. Level up! That's cool. Oh yeah. But after we had the ammunition upgrades to the main cannon, it's actually not a bad cannon anymore. It actually packs some punch. Wow. Oh shit. What are you doing? Stupid. Oh, that was close. Oh no. Oh god, what is it doing? Alright, I need to get onto this thing before it dies. And the machine gun fires is like everywhere. Atlas is still many percent left. Okay, let's see here. Material, fuel, ammo. Oh shit, this has no fuel. Oh, it's. Oh, never mind. It's fly fish box. Which is blockaded. What is that doing? Okay, let's go to the. Let's just see that. Ooh. Right. So Atlas is down, which means that everything can go and attack Water Buffalo instead. Oh no, it's just Mepra's shots everywhere. 
Meh, but I... Oh shit, where, why, why am I here? Oh no, did something die? Oh, this guy taken is super sad. Nothing died, but... Okay, I don't know why I ended up in the water, though. Oh no! Snorri XL needs assistance. I want it up in the air. It's actually doing a pretty good job here. <laughs> Even though it's uh, laying around and shilling. <clears throat> okay, how strong is this thing? Oh no, this looks pretty, pretty nice actually. It looks like a pretty strong vessel. Alright, gear taken is going into frontal combat. Um, Oh no. I just want to support this Geotiken because it's the only one that's actually engaging the craft. So this is our hope. And this is also our screenshot. No, wait. I change keyboards, that's why it doesn't work all the time. Oh yes, there we have it. Maybe maybe in a screenshot. I know. I should care about the campaign and not the screenshots, but anyways. Oh well, this is interesting. Can Geotik can take this? It's so interesting. So Snorri Excel gets bombarded while this Geotik can actually wrecks the thing for, well, when it's here, which is weird. Oh no. Oh, oh this is the Snorri Excel. Never mind. It looked weird without the flying things. Alright. Oh, this looks pretty cool. Actually, I kind of... <laughs> I kind of want to teleport to the closest gear taken. Just because, you know get that hood back on. And now... Fire! Oh no, I think we need to... just turn it a little bit in this direction. We can... fire... I think the AI might be doing a better job than us at actually controlling the craft. Oh no, I think so. That's kind of sad. Oh no, <laughs> it shoots at us. Okay, so let's just turn this direction here. Oh no. We might actually be fucking this up by trying to control it manually. Okay, come on, fire! Okay, never mind. Um, I'll just jump back to Snorri Excel and let it makes it own make take let it take control. Like we can't use the fail saves and shit with uh, you know we can't use all the fail saves and everything like that when we are using the manual control mode which basically wrecks everything. I guess we have to have really, uh, really strong um, movement limitations for the guns and that one, then it would work. But, uh, you know, this one is supposed to only aim at our targets, which means that uh, it doesn't have the problem of shooting itself because it only aims at things in the air anyways. Which is not the case when we take manual control over the thing. Okay, so... Oh no. That's sad. I don't know why Flyfish Box never can participate in the battle, but well, well. This is 
pretty tough. Where is the other gear taking? We want reinforcements. Okay. We're just gonna teleport to this and see what the heck it's... Oh god. Oh yeah, okay. We can straighten it up. Alright, that's sad. Well, we have we have something called telekinesis. I'm not really sure how to use telekinesis. Let's see here. <laughs> it's probably something written in the. Now let's see here. The V menu, no? Yes. Power. Inputs. No. C. X menu. Seat menu. No. So if I try to build on this one, I can't use the simple flick. Alright. Okay, so here we have the telekinesis. Come on, flip! I'm not sure what I'm doing. Magnet bot attachments. Can I just make it push it up or something? Maybe not. Okay, let's see if I can find some documentation here. Maybe like... Okay, I found some documentation thing. So, if we use telekinesis... We can roll counter and counterclockwise. <laughs> I don't know from what angle. Okay, this is impossible. Come on. Roll, damn it. Okay, it doesn't roll. Right, so we'll just jump to another. We just jump to the good old Snorri Exod, which is on the floor as general. Oh, fly fish box is in battle. Nice. In that case. Oh, now everything is. Ah, I see. We already won. Engaging now. Okay, good. Uh, now we just want to go into the seed menu and switch anything to combat. Combat. And everything attack. Engaging now. Great. So this this is my favorite gear taken. This is this bitch is like the savior. She is wrecking all the enemy fleets herself. Oh yeah, <laughs> basically that's kind of true. Oh nice, we won this battle. And you know what? This is the excellent place to stop this episode so i hope you have enjoyed this little battle thing and we will be uh, you know we're at this moment constructing things at base uh, let's see her starting fortress and oh before i forget oh shit no wait um now i'm confused okay base here at base we're also having this uh, but we're building on our nice ship here so of course we will not build here but I saw on the map apparently we have some what's this 
Some enemy died over there? I don't know. That's weird. Never mind. Um, I learned something last time. Uh, apparently our setup is not very efficient because we are depleting the material faster than it can be generated. So it's actually better if we have less things that steal the material and let it build up instead. Alright, this is now we're slowly increasing the material. So if I had this one there as well. Zone has 14, 13, 14, 13, 14, 13. Okay, we'll let it increase a little bit so we just have just have that. So it can slowly build up. And that should apparently be more efficient. What do I know? But thanks for to, thanks to the people in the comments, you know, and uh, you usually make sure to tell me. Anyways, thank you very much for watching. This is Jim Edison, Total Notary Channel, with another From the Depth episode. Signing out. No, we need to change keyboards to 